Hi, Jared from Refever. I wanted to talk to you about the most important test kit to purchase. If you couldn't afford any other test kit, this is the one that you need to buy. Um, just to give you an example, I have an all SPS tank. I have about a daily consumption and I have mainly frags. Uh, things are still growing and when things grow like crazy, you're going to be consuming even more than what I consume. But I have a daily consumption of about 0.5 dkh, 0.5 dkh. And so the thing about it is when you're first starting up a calcium reactor or dosing system, you need to be testing alkalinity daily. Let me tell you why. Well, when I first started my calcium reactor, I had always used dosing systems in the past. The instructions are kind of overwhelming. There's a lot of moving parts. You've got a CO2 tank, you've got the doser, you've got, you know, everything else. You've got the effluent rate, you've got the drip rate, the bubble rate, all that stuff. So, <sighs> the thing that really sucks is I was, I didn't read the instructions right. And so what happened was I went from 8.5 dkh to 11.5 dkh pretty much overnight. Luckily I didn't kill any corals, but um, that was enough to learn my lesson. So I let the, I let, I didn't do any drastic measures. I let the um, DKH slowly drop over time. And uh, currently I'm running seven and a half to eight DKH. And my corals, my SPS love that range right there. So I try to keep it within that range. Um, alkal like I said, alkalinity is the most important thing to test. Initially, you wanna do it daily when you're first starting your, your dosing system. If you're doing um, you know, manual dosing, then you could probably you know, do it a little bit less frequently. I would still do it daily just to kind of see how much you need, how much alkalinity you need to add a day. But um, you, once you get everything set up and you kind of know, okay, things are starting to grow, there's not an explosion of growth going on, you could probably back off to like every other day or every third day, you know, twice a week. If you really wanted to and wanted to save money, you could probably go to, you know, once a month, one, uh, not once a month, once a, once a week. But um, the whole point is, this is the most important thing to buy. Um, if you had to choose any of the test kits to purchase, this is it.